Oh, I love it. Gotta love it. I love it. I love it. Do you love it? I hope you love it. Hey beauties, welcome back to my channel. So dolls, today's video is by, y'all already know, one of my favorite vendors, RPG Show. This is the wig that I'm going to be reviewing today. It's a short layered unit. Let me let you guys see what the cap construction looks like. Get into it. This is RPG show, so you know it's going to be HD lace. And I expect to have an easy install. Now, today is Cinco de Mayo. I don't know when y'all gonna get this video, but um, <laughs> I wanted to go outside for a little drinky drink. Anybody who knows me know I'm not really much of a drinker, but Cinco de Mayo. Right, But guys, I went to my post office box today and I have like 10 wigs. My anxiety is through the roof. I'm going to be recording for the next week to get this under control. But real quick, before I give you details about this unit, I might do two wigs in this video just simply because RPG show originally sent me this wig and I felt like the blonde was a little too light for my complexion. So they went ahead and sent me another wig. But one thing about RPG show is I really like working with them because they're accommodating. You guys know when I tell y'all, I don't just review any wigs that is sent to me. I promise you that I don't. Sometimes if the wig is just not up to par, I'll just decline the whole collaboration. But I already know RPG show does quality wig, so that's not the issue. But they were so accommodating with sending me a replacement wig. I might just go ahead and install this wig after the short wig, just to let you guys get an idea of what it looks like. And who knows, you might like it. So just be prepared. You might be in for a two for one. Back to this unit. I'm going to go ahead and clean my forehead. I'm gonna use this cleaning astringent. This is the equivalent to Seabreeze. I used to use this all the time. And then I got out of the habit of using it. And I don't know why. It's a lot better than alcohol. It's not as drying and it's better for your skin. So as you guys can see, the unit does come pre-plucked. The knots are bleached and they are small. And this lace is lacing. This should melt really good. Let's go ahead and install it. Okay guys, so for today's video, I have two new lace sprays from Eben New York. One is the melted spray and one is the keratin. So I wanna try them out. I'm not sure which one I wanna use. Let's see, any, meeny, miny, mo. Okay, let's go with this one. Now that my forehead is already clean, I'm gonna just go ahead and spray the lace and lay it down. For the edges. So I can show you what I'm gonna do. Alone, 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 alone with you, my love. Tie it down again. I used to skip this part for my installs, but once I really started taking the time to do this, I noticed a major difference in how it came out. When installing your unit, always remember to run over your unit with a hot comb. 
And when I say hot comb the unit, I don't just mean adding some wax dip to the top of the unit and straightening the top. I also mean parting the unit down about two inches at least on both sides. Of course, it's gonna depend on how deep your lace goes and flattening your unit from there and working your way up. This makes the difference between an average unit and a melted unit. I appreciate that this wig still has curls in it after all I've been doing to it. I'm gonna just try to refresh these curls. So you guys know 90% of the time when you're curling the front of your hair, you're gonna curl it away from your face. That's the best way to have the curls lay and frame your face. Now I'm gonna just add some of my root touch up to clean that part and space out a little bit. I used to skip this step before and I realized it made for a less cleaner install. I just couldn't deny Something starts to burst in my chest deep inside Why do love like this hurt? Oh my God It feels like, it feels like I'm gonna die It feels like, it feels like I'm about to die Okay guys, you know it's time for me to switch it up. This is a middle part unit. Y'all know I'm team side part. So of course, I'm gonna try <laughs> and move this unit over to the side. So first I just tried this flip up method and it turned out really cute. It's giving Jennifer Hudson, Coco Jones. I don't know, these are the type of units that they wear. And I told you guys before, when you see me start smiling a lot in my videos, that's a clear indication that your girl is really feeling the unit. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love this unit. This is cute. The way that this hair is layered, it feels like it's my hair. It's layered so nicely, and especially for it to be such a natural length with these deep layers, this is gonna look so bomb. Wearing it straight down, it's gonna frame your face. You could also wear it flipped up. The styles are endless, and it's such a natural, beautiful length, especially with spring and summer being here. These are perfect for the weather perfect for vacation and definitely perfect for an everyday unit. Very light and carefree. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. This is definitely not like every other wig that I get. <laughs> Y'all, I really love when I get a wig that is different because Lord knows I'm tired of doing the same wig reviews with different names. <laughs> And this is RPG Social. You already know this is a quality unit. Their name carries weight, so you can purchase with confidence. I am gonna go ahead and show you guys the other unit. And let me know in the comment section below which unit you like best. 
okay y'all so this is the second unit i'm not gonna lie they ate with this unit as well the way they layered this unit is phenomenal a lot of times i get a lot of straight layered unit and they barely be layered as you guys can see this unit is layered now the blonde i still think is a little too light for my complexion I haven't really decided if I'm going to keep this unit or if I'm going to sell it on my website. However, if I do decide to keep this unit, I'm just going to go on top of that with some Wella Tona and just kind of tone down this blonde. But what I really like about this unit is the way the blonde peeks through on the ends. It's kind of like a subtle hint of blonde without being too overpowering. I'm going to turn around real quick so you can see what it looks like from the back. So dolls, don't forget to let me know in the comment section which unit you like best. And before we get out of here, I'm gonna need your help naming both of these units. What do you think we should call them? Go ahead and leave your name suggestions in the comment section down below. And I did pick a name for the unit I reviewed in my last video. The new name as well as the person who submitted the name will be listed across the screen. So dolls, if you find this video helpful, don't forget to give your girl a thumbs up. And if you're not already part of the faithful fam, hit that subscribe button and join the family and it's always important until next time you guys stay blessed and if it be god's will i'll see you in my next video take care now